So a lot of my friends are getting into PC gaming and they always come up to me and ask me units can this computer run CSGO can this computer run Far Cry Primal and they'll send me the specs of it and it'll be like a Pentium with like a horrible graphics card and what I tell them is that all you have to do is buy a graphics buy a 750 Ti you know GTX 750 Ti if you just put it with the Pentium it, it can run CSGO at 100 frames close to 200 frames per second on high settings because all of my friends they feel like they need to buy cyber powers alienwares you know all these high-end PCs when you can easily just you know spend a hundred dollars on a 750 Ti put it into your computer and bam you're already playing CSGO on 10, 1080p high settings 200 FPS I mean you won't be able to play you know the newest games like games that you know witcher crisis you know things like that you can also upgrade your cpu depending on your motherboard you just have to find out compatibility you can easily turn your home pc into a mid-range gaming pc which is actually really good it will save you a lot of money and especially if you don't know how to build computers you know i mean you could watch like an hour video on youtube there's videos everywhere I, for me to learn all this stuff it, i took a year time and every single day i went home i just watched videos videos I learn more about graphics for CPUs things like that and it helps me out a lot learning things like I'm able to help my friends I'm like yo go buy a 750 the reason I'm saying like to buy a 750 Ti is because they're super cheap they're well not super cheap they're the best budget graphics cards out there and they can run really good games on you know high settings or max settings things like that because you don't all need you know GTX 980s in your computers and like an Alienware or a cyber power or even I know those are like four hundred dollars depending on the thing but you're actually getting ripped off from that because you could easily build a computer for what 200 or, or 300 and they're selling it for 400 my friends need to understand that you don't need a cyber power or you don't need things like that because they have really good PCs at home with you know the newest PCs that come out that you buy from Best Buy and Walmart things like that they come with core i5s which are really good CPUs just put hell if you even want to spend more a little bit more money you could put a gtx 800 series in it and it can run even better games but what i'm saying is gtx 750 ti's right now they cost around 100 the other day i saw them on ebay for 70 dollars to to really get the best price range because i know a lot of people are on a tight budget and they can't afford the latest hardware and so you can easily just turn your pc home into a gaming pc and installing a graphics card isn't as hard as it seems because most people are scared to open their PCs and to even mess with the parts like all you do is you just unplug the graphics card out of there and you just plug in the new graphics card and that's it that's really just it it's that simple it's just plugging something out plugging something in run your new computer install some driver updates or whatever you need and bam you're you're running on a really good PC and my PC is a Intel Core 2 Duo with like a Radeon 3k series and that's a horrible PC I need to upgrade it so much more but I'm working on to building a better PC because this PC takes DDR2 RAM and you can't find you know 8 gigabyte sticks of DDR2 RAM in one RAM slot or whatever you know but I hope this helped you out on making your home pc into a mid-range gaming pc anyways i hope you guys enjoyed peace let's call it in the crossfire let's call it in the crossfire